climbed your big brother some years back. Yee, one of the stranger things I've collected along the years. A Spanish doubloon found in a German U-boat in the middle of a jungle. Who would have thunk? Sir Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Look at us. Shambhala. <laughs> Miss you, pal. So many men killed each other for a piece of this. Thanks for nothing, St. Dismas. <laughs> Not really my style anymore. Now this was a crazy ride. Yeah. They come. Take cover. Surrounded. Bullseye. Take that. All right. And that. Eat plastic. Back in business. Gotcha. Yeah, bring it. Like a pro. So long. That'll teach you. See ya. <laughs> Still got it. Eat plastic. Hey, Nate. Are you coming down to eat? Yeah. Yeah, I'll be right there. Well, playtime's over. Is this what you're working on? Wow, we 
really need to go on another vacation. It's been too long. So, so boring stuff. Tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is going to like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs, like the second that you got off the plane. So, kind of took this blue turn. And Ah! What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. <laughs> oh, really? I'm, what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? what? This one? It's about, you know, the uh, lost city of Bangkok. Not, not of Bangkok, lost city near Bangkok. In or about the city limits of Bangkok. Wow. All right, I'm sorry. No, it was valiant. It I was, was in the really ballpark, right? In a different state, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really. I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't seen him Elena. in about two years. Look, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Oh, stop, I'll do them. No, you on. did them last night. No, you cooked. I clean. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, um... Uh, Play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. 
You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? Oh, wow. Okay, cowboy. Okay, watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning all right. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just, uh, how do you, uh, how do you make it go? Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera. Got it. And the circle button is your spin a -tick. Spin a Yeah, and press X to jump. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. That's something hurt. You're going the wrong way. Huh? Run towards the bottom. I know, I know. I just like to explore, you know? Watch that pit. I'm watching it. I watched it. What is that thing, a fox? A bandicoot. Looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Okay, smash the boxes. There's a fox smash. Ow! Oh, that had to hurt. It did probably hurt. So why do you keep playing this? Because I'm really great at it. I don't know why people get into video games. <laughs> Use your spin attack. Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. I don't look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? Uh, no, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. Uh, these graphics are pretty good, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Poor fox. Bandicoot. Okay. Agree to disagree. Last life. You gotta make it count. Oh, I so got this. Okay, grab the fruit. What does the fruit do? A hundred gives you an extra life. A hundred? Who's got time to pick a hundred pieces of fruit? <laughs> that was, that was, that was not too bad. Good, good, there you go. Is that it? You asked for it. Oh. oh. You gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really? really? You're gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way I'm, easier on I'm, you. I'm warning you. What are you gonna do? I'm warning you. In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. What can you I'm do in real you. life? What do you think about that? <laughs> <Huh>? <laughs> Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Um. Um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. Yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. 
Nothing less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. My God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Hey, but I... I mean... Calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. <sighs> Nathan, we killed a guard. Okay, so they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. He said, Sam, I. Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. would have come back. I know, Nathan. I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey. You still with me? Need some air. You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. It's a lot to digest, you know? But how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, right, right. Slow down. Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. What's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. They tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. <sighs> These were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train <laughs> in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man. What did I miss? Jesus, Sam, where do I start? Start with the best part. A few years back, I got roped into uh, breaking into this Turkish museum to steal this oil lamp, okay? Oil lamp? What is uh, it? it was an artifact from Marco Polo's lost treasure fleet. Kubla Khan's treasure. Yeah. Yeah, and as it turns out, it was a whole hell of a lot more on those ships than just treasure. I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and uh, we made it out alive. Barely. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring, the engagement ring. I'm married. I can't believe I, Elena from the stories. That's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner. At my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan. I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Does the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but um, last year he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. <laughs> 